<sighs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Grizzly Station. Uh, this is a another video in the series that you won't die nor start up again. This is Dumb Spiracy Episode Two. Today we're gonna talk about flat earthers. Let's see. Uh, let's see if if the Earth is 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 flat. You got mail. Choo choo. Go. Hello, everybody. I call this video the simplest, irrefutable flat Earth proof. <laughs> now I know there's going to be some people who will watch this who know me personally. And people who know me personally uh, know that I am not a fool. Everyone who knows me knows I'm not a fool. What kind of fucking argument is that? Because you know who I am, what I say is irrefutable proof. Because I am not a fool. When I first heard about the Flat Earth a year ago, or a little more, I totally ignored it. Because I thought, come on, that's foolish. <laughs> that's how that's how I'm feeling right now. And that's that's natural, that's normal. Because we've all been brainwashed by scientism. Whoa. <laughs> I just want you to know that if you're ever feeling brainwashed by scientism, here's a number you can call because scientism is no joke. Over 40 years ago, when I was a math major in college, I turned totally away from faith, and I did believe that math was God. I did. But we have been deceived. No more science. No more believe in science. We're done with it. Okay, this airplane... Oh my god, he's grabbing a toy airplane. ...is going to fly always... No. ...at a level altitude with, re with respect to the Earth. I, I, I think another common trope that flat earthers use is that there's a lack of common sense. But what about when you're going from north to south? And this is this is the proof, and you can't deny it. Continuing to dip down, and finally, I get down here to Antarctica. And look at that. My airplane is upside down. In replacement of this common sense, it is more of an act of literal. So, you know, if the earth is, is round, like we say, then we'd be falling upside down when we go south. No, y y dumbass. It's like they forget that gravity exists. Well, you're going to say, well, we know that people that are in the southern hemisphere are still standing right side up. Everybody stands right side up on the earth. We know that. But yet you just flew down here. You're upside down. You cannot... Refute that. Your airplane is upside down and your head is facing down. No. We're going to limit this video to three three videos because I think I'm going to give myself a lobotomy after this. I found one that says, uh, shocking flat earth proof. I am still in shock. You must watch this. Flat earth messenger. Why are there no moon movies? Uh, I don't know. I've never, you know what? I've never seen a moon movie yet at all in my entire life. There are no pictures of, of Earth from space. This man is this man is asking all the questions that that need answers. You know what? I've I've always wondered why I could never uh, just waltz into Antarctica. You know, where, where are they keep him back there? My 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 idea is that they got some they got some gold deep in those Antarctica 
Antarctic hills. They probably got probably got some crazy, like a crazy water park or something that, that they don't want anyone else to go to. They're, they're saying, stay out. There's nothing. You can't come to our water park in Antarctica. That's our water park. No one else. Out of here, everyone. It's Tex again here at the Man Cave. <laughs> who the... Who, who is this guy? Take a look at him again. This here is blue. Big, wet, and blue sphere. See that? Fucking take everything I said and just throw it away. I'm already sold. I'm on board. He's the captain now. He's the cowboy captain. It's even got its own North Pole, by golly. Y'all help me figure this out. Or just admit the fact that Earth is flat. That was fucking zero to a hundred. What? What was this point? Dropping the mic. He just fucking. Yo. Just admit the fact that Earth is flat. <laughs> help me figure this out. <laughs> or just admit the Earth is flat. <laughs> that Earth is flat. Normal people are going out and doing experiments. And one of the experiments has turned up um, an amazing fact that we've not been told. And it, it destroys the whole idea of this, this uh, heliocentric system. Um, and that is the moon. Now, you can actually measure the temperature of the moonlight next to the, me the temperature of the uh, shade of the moonlight. And you'll find the moonlight is colder than a shade, the opposite from the sun. So the moon is throwing out its own light, and that light is the opposite from the sun. Just, I just don't get it. I don't understand. The other question is, well, how come ships don't go off the sea if it's flat? How come ships don't fall off the edge? Well, here's why you don't fall off the edge. It's a 200 to 300 foot high wall. It's a 200 to 300 foot high wall. Yeah. This is just a compilation of dumb people saying dumb things. I found a site, uh, this is the Flat Earth Society. Uh, you can find it at the f www.tfes.org. These fuckers got an org. Wow, they already right off the bat, our connection to the site is not fully secure. So if I get a virus, we know it's just the uh, globalists trying to take us down. All right, let's go to the facts, and here we see, is this site a joke? Here's their answer. This site is not a joke. We are actively promoting the Flat Earth movement worldwide. There are, admittedly, several non-serious Flat Earth posters, but they are fairly easy to identify. What evidence do you have? I think that's a fair question. The evidence for a flat earth is derived from many different facets of science and philosophy. The simplest is relying on one of one's own senses to discern the true nature of the world around us. The world looks flat. The bottoms of the clouds are flat. This is using what's called an empirical approach, or an approach that relies on information from your senses. There's no such thing as hallucinations now. Two. Uh, you know, everyone is a genius and their senses are irreparable. I think this whole thing started as a joke. One guy probably thought, hey, you know what would be funny? If we got all these other idiots to think that the earth was flat. Yeah, that would be funny. I'm mad. We're done. We're done here. Uh, you, you know what? I'll... I'll do, mm. If you have a conspiracy you want me to get pissed off about, then by all means, tweet me here. Point me your dumb conspiracies, because I would love to, I would love to see them. All right, I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you for watching.